Hello, welcome to my channel. It's William Jamming, and uh, you're watching a series of video of how to use Illustrate on your iPad. And um, so previously we talked about pen, and let's talk more free um, shape tool pencil. I love this. I think this is one of the like my favorite tool in, in Illustrator, whether it's on iPad or on the computer. Okay, so let's uh, get to it. So for example, we got this uh, William Jamming WJM, um, but uh, I don't want this. I want something more interesting. So for example, I want to choose, uh, I want to make something like more organic. Okay, so for example, I want a cat. Okay, I can't possibly like a click. Of course, I can do that um, if I want to, you know, build a cat from basic shape, like a design cat logo, something like that. But uh, most of the time I want like because I'm more like an artist rather than a designer. Um, so I want more free, like freedom when I create things. So for example, I usually say I want a cat. I will just draw a cat like this, okay? Draw a cat, say there will be a tail, something like that, okay? And then, bro, 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 maybe something like this, and something like this, and like the air. Okay, so it's more like something like this. So I want more freedom, so I will just um, draw cat this way. And then change the property and change the feel to a color that I want. So for example, it's a, it's a cute black cat. I can do that. And then after you have done this, you can add something more. Okay, so let me just get rid of this. Um, so for example, I'm going to make it more at the center of the screen. Um, maybe make it a little bit fatter, so cuter. And then this, I want to change. So I want like individual select, okay? So if you look at here, this is just way too much. So I will just, sorry. I will just select and make the whole point a little bit inside. So it's a little bit hard for me to click and drag. Okay. And here, let's click and drag. Okay. And maybe here, let's just change the curve. Okay, so I can modify this. Of course, you can simplify the, the whole process later. Right now, I just want to show you it is doable. And then once I got like a clip art sort of a thing, I can add another thing. So for example, I can add then say shape. So for example, I will add shape like here. I guess sometimes uh, if the shape is, is gone, you can click again and select a specific shape. So for example, I want the uh, feel to be, uh, yeah, maybe I want this feel to be, uh, maybe to be white. I don't want a black cat because it's maybe, yeah, my, uh, my camera just got like up a little bit. Let's change it by, okay, because I got a um, camera, I use my phone as a camera and the um, the support Paul um, have to, you know, um, let me just make a, okay, white cat. And then um, let me just change the stroke to say about 10. Okay, that's more like it. And then um, I want to add a, say I, so the shape, okay, let me change the shape. And I want to shape the feel to be black. Okay, and then I will draw, say, the eye here, one and two. Okay, in order for it to be like a cute, I have to choose this one and maybe change the shape a tiny little bit. So it's more like this. So yeah, and my camera just got up again. Sorry about that. 
I have to adjust it. It's become a little bit annoying. I'm going to use more book to fix this. Okay, so this should do. Okay, and uh, let me make it even more. And I can rotate it, by the way. Rotate it. Yeah, so a nice cat. And um, whisk also need to add, so I can add, say, line. Okay, the shape line. Yeah, I don't think we need to worry about the line as well as the razor because, yeah, I will use this when I make this video. Okay, then maybe one or two. Okay, I'm going to just add two. Maybe three. Okay, maybe three. And then I can choose that and make it more, say, curve, something like that. Okay. Yeah, maybe not a curve like this. Just add in a tiny little bit of variation. So make it a little bit interesting curve. And then I can make it like curve down a little bit. So up and down. Okay, and here make it down. Mainly it's, it's down. Yeah, something like this. And then I also can add a little bit of basing. I think the default is pretty good. So yeah, default is pretty good. Let me just use default. Okay, so the whisk is already pretty good. And then I can just use another shape to got this maybe a triangle. Okay, just add a tiny little bit. Okay. And then I can Rotate a little bit, okay, and select this and make it something like this, smaller, maybe that will be much cuter. Two fingers to undo things. Sorry. Um, maybe just make it here. Okay, and so for example, you want this to have a like more rounded, you can click here and add some basil at um, left and right side. Okay, so make it more rounded here. Okay, so yeah, so I got a nice cat, and then you can add a tiny little bit of detail, say. Um, let me use pen for this one. Okay, so dot, 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 dot. Yeah, something like that. And then it will automatically close the shape. So if you want a little bit curve, you can use the like individual select. Um, yeah, I think I need to like manually close this. Let me undo this. Let me undo this. Um, maybe just pencil. I want it to be like more rounded. Yeah, something like that. Just to add a, a tiny uh, little variation so it won't get like too boring. Okay, so nice little cat will be here. Okay. Um, so, um, I think that's pretty much all about the pen as well as the pencil. We can use eraser if you like. Okay, of course, you, you don't want this, you can always like erase this, okay? So, uh, it will automatically, like, for example, you erase what's inside, you get the outside, like, automatically redraw. Uh, so, um, yeah, yeah, Two, three fingers to redo things. Uh, I think that's pretty much all for this video okay so yeah for example you, you got this one on erase you can also like erase this part as well yeah I believe it's like a starting point I can't do that um, then I have to you know select this and change say the basil um, here so for example I can make it something like this a quick overlap uh, that should do 
Yeah. Um, so thanks, and uh, see you next video. Okay.